Oscar Bevis for IFL TV in association with MTK Global. Just rocked up at York Hall and saw the man himself, <laughs> Mr. Casey Kadevi. How are you, sir? You're all, right? all good, Oscar. Man, how are you? Been? You good? Yeah, good, mate. Busy, busy. Um, right, you're out here, December the fourteenth for the WBO European at Superfly. Talk mm. to me about it. Yeah, so I mean, um, this fight came. We wanted a towel uh, to end the year with a towel, and um, my manager's done a hell of a job. Um, Alfie Warren, and he's got me the fight for WBO um, European Superflyweight. So we've got. Um, We've got Pedro Matos, I think he fought Sonny Edward for, I think it was a WBO International, one of them towel. So he's is been it, over here before then? Yeah, yeah, they fought in Royal Albert, so uh, he's, he's been here before. But uh, first time in Yoko, so Yoko is different. Yoko is a home to me, and uh, I put a different performance in Yoko, man. So he's a stiff fight, I mean, we've got a good game plan against him, but like I said, I don't see nothing else apart me holding that title around my waist. So. You said you were looking to end the year with a title, and obviously you got a title shot. What sort of stuff was there put forward to you? So any, any other things or was it just sort of once you saw that this was the opportunity you had to go for this? Um, this was the opportunity, we couldn't get nothing else, I mean we, was, we, wanted, to the, we wanted the English fight and um, they were just ignoring us, we, we sent plenty of good offers, I'm sure we sent him way better offer than who did he, he recently lost to. Um, and then yeah, I mean, the new champion, he's, he's got, I think he's got a better offer fighting Sonny Edward for the British title. So he's gone a different route and we just for, for this opportunity for us to get a towel around us and WBO European was the right title for us to, to go after. And um, that will open many doors for us for next year. I was going to say, obviously, there's a lot of routes you can take in boxing, obviously the British and Southern area, those sort of routes, but you decided to go straight for the European for your first title fight. Um, yeah, going to unlock some big doors for you, potentially, if you keep winning as well, it'll sort of give you that fast track to world level? Yeah, yeah, 100%. That's, that's what we look at. We look in the fastest track to the world, uh, world level. I mean, that's the aim to get the world title fight, and um, like I said, we couldn't get a Southern area title. We couldn't get an English, uh, English title, so uh, the fight we couldn't get those fights. So now it's, I mean, the British uh, fight would have happened, but we didn't get no offers from Sonny because he was mandatory for it. So we didn't, he didn't send us no offers down the line for us, and uh, and but hopefully we'll meet up for uh, me and him. We'll be on a, we'll be fighting on a bigger title between each other, and you know, it's just that's what it is, man. So. Obviously, you're both in your own paths at the moment. He's fighting Marcel Braithwaite. Yeah. Break that, that break that fight down for me. What do you think is going to happen? Oh, Sonny. I think um, I reckon Sonny will stop him round eight, seven, maybe. I think Sonny's work work great and his um, elusiveness is too much for Marcel. Uh, Marcel's uh, he's a good boxer. You know, he's stiff. Um, his his rhythm can be read very quick. I mean, he's strong and all that, but his rhythm he's got a rhythm that can be read easily. Um, and, and Sonny got the right tools to beat him. Uh, Sonny will take, take it over around 7 8, maybe even stop him. He went it by point easily, but I think 7 8 will stop him. That's how I go. So. But I'll be there and I'll be there in that, in that show. So hopefully we get our build. We're going to go to Copper Box with our own build. Maybe even after Sonny win it, we might, you know, might jump in, in the ring. <laughs> <laughs> Let him know um, that you're there. Yeah, yeah. No, He's no, been quite vocal in saying on Twitter that there's a lot of people that don't want to face him. I mean, so. There's not many options for him as well he, at Superfly. It's not the most stacked division, so if you want to fight him, he wants to fight you, yeah. that's a fight that should, should happen. We, we do want to fight each other, but I think um, he's looking for, you know, he's been waiting for that British style for a long time, so he's got the chance to get that, and he'll get that. And he's going, I think he's going to get, he's going to go route for a wall tower as well, and if he, if he goes for a route to wall tower, then we'll meet there. Once he gets a wall tower, then if, we, if he gives him the chance to fight him, we'll fight there. Um, but yeah, man, I wish him nothing but the best, and, and he's very talented. Um, I've got a lot of respect from where he's come from. Him and his brothers on a hill. They've done a lot of stuff to get to where they are, and um, that as a man-to-man -man respect is always going to be there. But the fighting, um, he's got a dream. I've got a dream. Uh, I've got a dream, and so we're just going to have to meet up one day. Well, right, we'll look forward to it, Mr. Yeah. Casey Demi. Thank you very much for speaking thank to you. IFL TV. And, um, thank you for having me, Oscar. Of course. Good luck December the 14th, and hopefully, you. you manage to pick up the WBO European title. 100%.